good morning. Uh, it's not exactly good morning. So this is continuation of a seven mile rim. Well, I actually drove a little bit of Port House Rock Road yesterday at night to get to my uh, camp spot. And this is where I was camping just now. Uh, even my GoPro is still like it dribbles here, uh, but it's already covered in water there. It was raining quite heavily. And the whole area there, it's coming from there to here. So I'm not sure how much videoing uh, I'm gonna do today, but I still wanna continue. I came to right now to drive a Hidden Canyon road. It's like a green trail. Then I'm gonna connect back to Port House. Uh, 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 rock trail which right away will grow into seven mile rim trail uh, which is the easiest portion of it it's like not by the cliffs it's more like in between buttes and stuff You know, I'm still waiting for uh, my weather report. Uh, takes a while, it's clouds, right? So satellite signal doesn't go through all, the, all that well. Uh, that green trail I just mentioned, uh, it's all sandy and stuff uh, to the hidden canyon. So there's probably some washes. Yeah, that green may become uh, very blue right now. I have no idea. This is, yeah. And uh, Rob just texted me, we're doing a uh, Pritchett uh, uh, pre pre uh, Canyon Road, uh, which is one of the hardest red trails in the area. Uh, like, well, dude, just texted back, like, dude, <laughs> careful in this weather, right? Because all the rocks, everything, uh, like, especially when you need to do crawling, starts to become slippery. So some of those hard obstacles may become extreme. Um, yeah, so I'll uh, continue driving, I guess. Maybe I'll set up a GoPro inside here. Actually, I have a harness, so I'll do that. This was the Hidden Canyon Drive. Now rain kind of stopped. Uh, it's still probably gonna rain on and off today. Uh, not bad. Uh, driving through the wash was whatever. Uh, I thought maybe there could be a little bit of water running, but no, even with this rain, it's like nothing. Uh, so now I turned on to uh, courthouse uh, rock, uh, part of a loop, but it's also part of Seven Mile Rim. 
so it's like same thing. I'll just complete the courthouse loop, sort of get on highway and uh, see where to go from there. Or uh, if maybe start going to Mojave Desert, I don't know. Like it's gonna be like this for the next three days. It's like can't really shoot stuff, can't really take pictures, can't really fly drone. Well, right now I can, but who knows, maybe like in an hour, that's it. And uh, it's also a little cold too. Uh, not exactly vacation I was looking for. I was looking for a nice southern heat. Uh, and this place is too touristy. It's like you bump into people, jeeps all the time. Uh, I'm tired of sharing my uh, sleep places with a bunch of uh, uh, campers and RVs and all that stuff. Uh, it's like I want to take a shower seriously already and uh, I can't. I wake up there's people around uh, and it's kind of chilly too. But chilly I could bypass but people around. So, uh, at least I'm still not paying for uh, spots. Like yesterday actually I ended up sleeping in the exact same spot where I slept when I arrived at uh, Moab. Just because it's in the area. Well, let's uh, let's continue the courthouse rock. It's blue trail, so it can probably take a bit of time. Hopefully, uh, no areas got uh, uh, like muddy. Uh, we'll see.
from Seven Mile Rain return to Courthouse Rock and now exit highway. So, what's next? I don't know. Uh, all I know is I'm sitting at 30 psi and I'm not highway ready. Uh, like if I was at 35 ish, I would be okay kind of driving into town all that. But at 30, I'm way too unstable. I turn like I can feel it on highway uh, turns. Uh, my car just wants to kind of go its own way at 30. But it's perfect because uh, right there I see a Chevron. I mean, I have a pump, but just like I was saying before, uh, I would need to open up, unpack, you know, shut the car, connect the wires, uh, start the pumping. It would take uh, each tire maybe, I don't know, like five minutes, 20 minutes. Wait for the compressor to cool down before I can back all this crap away. Uh, I mean, in extreme situations where you need to hit highway, whatever road, and you don't have a gas station nearby, sure, that's what I would do. But why? If if I if I only need to drive five, ten miles to some closest gas station, if there is one in the area, I would do it. I would pay like three bucks or whatever to pump, quickly pump a tire and get it done and just be over. So today is 27th September and uh, I want to be home on 8th. Mm. Ideally, ideally somewhere midday, so I still have half a day to do stuff, shop and whatever. And then uh, the next whole day just to kind of climatize back into the real life. Uh, so that means on the 7th I need to start heading back. Uh, from wherever I am and today is 27th half day so I got about nine days left pretty much of uh, cruising around doing stuff I've decided I'm gonna go to uh, uh, Canyon Lands Overlook um, that's like a blue trail something uh, it's about three o'clock right now so I should be able to get there by the end with nice view it's BLM land, so uh, there is no designated campground that I can see, uh, at least in the book. Uh, but maybe our lander app or something can do it. Or, since it's BLM land, maybe I can just drive off on some patch of land and camp out. Uh, so, beautiful view from there. And then I guess uh, I'll, I'll sleep there, basically. And uh, from there, tomorrow, I'll be doing... Uh, I'll go down more south, so then I'll do the... Uh, Lockhart Canyon and after that uh, which is I think green blue kind of trail and after that uh, uh, the red trail Lockhart Basin it's rated one of the easier ones so actually I'll double check on the difficulty but uh, I don't think it, it's uh, that difficult at all uh, hopefully there is no sideway kind of like 30 degree slopes and that kind of stuff right let's hit the road
my friends. Check this out. This was uh, worth a drive. And this is not even the Overlook. Overlook is still... I need to drive. This is just a thing on the side. But uh, I'm digging my wake up view tomorrow. And uh, awesome thing is, I haven't seen a single... This is south of Moab. Driving on highway, maybe half an hour, 40 minutes, something like that. Okay, maybe an hour, I don't know. But uh, as soon as I hit, went off the highway, not a single soul. And I've been driving for like half an hour or something. So, chances are, when I arrive there, there's no one. And it's all BLM land. So, sweet. And th this could be the opportunity spot. Like, uh, there is a fireplace over here. Uh, I have still bundle of wood from uh, Grand Canyon. And there's, a, there's plenty of starter, uh, Tinder. Just park uh, backwards, right in this little ledge here to raise my back and yeah, just morning view. <laughs> uh, I will take a shower tomorrow, although holy, it's kind of cold and uh, once it gets uh, uh, dark or early in the morning, that's it, it's, it's you know, unpleasant. So this is probably gonna be my uh, first cold shower in the wilderness and it's not gonna be pleasant. Uh, well, I'll probably heat up a bowl of water just, just to add it kind of quickly, mix it up, but uh, it's still not going to be pleasant uh, at all. Uh, so not not really looking forward to that one. Uh, well, we'll see. Because I can't wait for lunch to, uh, you know, for it to heat up and there's nothing to heat up from because it's supposed to be cloudy and rainy and whatever for the next three days or so, uh, periodically. Oh, yeah. Well, what can you do? Part of overlanding. In the distance there, uh, not the river, the other bridge thing. That's the basically Potash Road, the end of it. So you descend somewhere there or there and drive into that point. And uh, yeah, I guess one of the uh, Lockhart Canyon before the basin uh, is descend. Like I'll be driving, I guess, more that way uh, towards Moab to all that, and uh, somewhere in here, one of those two river loops is going to be the uh, access to the water. However, it's part of national park. That little bit of access to the water, national park. So uh, we'll see about fishing. I'm not doing guy fish in National Park, I guess. I don't know. So here is the final point, and it's kind of disappointing. I guess it's just a point. There's, uh, I don't see any campfire slot places, and uh, there's a little bit of civilization here. Check this out. It's actually a toilet here, and uh, over there there is uh, a table. But yeah, nowhere do I see a place to burn fire. So my assumption is. Uh, I guess I can't camp at this spot, or maybe I can. I probably can. I don't have to burn fire. 
I can just kind of park here and that's it. All I need is just to park. And it's kind of cold. That fire wouldn't save me actually today. Uh, maybe I should burn it somewhere else. Uh, like I actually just want to sit inside, you know, burn my uh, propane uh, heater and get to go. I guess for today, this is it. Sorry, not as exciting. Weather is not as exciting. Bad weather produces bad mood for shooting videos. You know, I'm not uh, as reluctant to come outside or... I actually wanted to fly a drone in, in one place today. Uh, and just as I took it from the bag, the rain started. It's like, oh god, okay, fine, fine. No, no, not much sh shooting today. I have yet to do the uh, top of world trails, uh, Hell's Revenge, um, many, many other trails. I still have like nine days. Uh, well, the low card basin tomorrow. Uh, so hit that like button, uh, subscribe, do the whole uh, Instagram, uh, Facebook. Facebook is kind of like my vlog, uh, blog, I mean. So you can leave me a message for that kind of stuff, you can maybe connect if you're in the area. So see you guys tomorrow. Hey comrades, don't forget to hit that like button and also leave a comment. And if you haven't subscribed yet, you should by hitting that subscription button and also bell notification next to it. So you can actually get my video updates, both in notification and your video feed. And as well, you can support this channel if you like my videos through PayPal or Patreon in the links down below or just after this video.